here and everyone present over here. It's my customary duty to present before you a brief roundup of the current academic session. Normally annual functions, people think that they are for a cultural program, but actually it should be for presenting before you the report of the school. OPI 2006, with only 8 students and 5 teachers, has now grown up into a big and repetitive school with 1,306 students and 50 qualified and experienced teachers. In its journey of progress, the school has set many records and broken its own records to set new goals for itself. This is the achievements and glories of our school, undoubtedly, but also makes us think deeply about our shortcomings. We set standards and goals for ourselves and strive to achieve them be it in the area of academics, sports, discipline, leadership, and more. Let me begin with academics. Here, of course, I am talking about the results of 10th and 12th. I do not talk that they were 100%, but I would like to inform you that Alka Patel of class 10th, she scored 98.4% marks, a towering one, making us elated for her achievements. Dear audience, out of 69 students in class 10, 21 scored 90% and above. It is almost one third of the total students who appeared. More than half, that is 38% uh, was our school average. Similarly, on the same ground, class 12, 91 students appeared, out of which 50, 15 students, they scored 90% and above marks of which 36 students got 80% and above marks. 52 students out of 91, more than half that is, they scored 75% and above marks. So their mental in prestigious competitive exams like JE, NEED and CUET as well. We have got two students selected for MBBS through NEED, three selections for IIT JE and good number of students got selected for even OP Jindal Global University and Delhi University through JE and CUET. Needless to mention, one of the students, Abhishek Singh, was from our current batch who got selected for IIT BHU. Please appreciate this student. Levels first. International GK Olympiad, home side of our school, was the state topper. In International English Olympiad, Akshat Piyush got international rank 9. Nirmal Rai got international rank 18. Similarly, Om Sai got Zonal Rank 11. In ISSO, Om Sai again got International Rank 5. Sambhavi Mishra and Iron Mandal got Zonal Rank 7. In NSO, once again Om Sai made us proud by becoming Zonal Rank 5 and Aisha Patnaya got Zonal Rank 11. In International Maths Olympiad, one of our students, Brigham Goyal, got International Rank 23. Even in sports, we are not lagging behind. Like our students participated in Sports and Game Federation of India, their Aryan Sarma of class 12th commerce got selected for national level. He will represent a Chhattisgarh state. From India and abroad participated and our students, they got fourth position in drama, including Sambhavi Mishra, Rehan Chaudhary, Namami Singh, Yashwantar Poydak and Trishana Kumar and fifth position in model making that is Ayush Devedi and Ritul Sarma. It is only that they rank up to five and our students, we had set three groups and out of that two groups they won prizes even at the international level. Painting competition, uh, Mr. Mudit Agrawal achieved first rank in inter-school drawing competition organized at OP Jindal School Raigad on the occasion of our founder's birthday, that is our Babuji's birthday. Similarly, in the field of music, our student got first rank in inter-school group competition organized at OP Jindal School Raigad on the occasion of our Babuji's birthday. In district level competition, called Ullas, our students from Jindal Children Home, just see, they have just joined but not lagging behind. In that, Prem Yadav of our Jindal Children Home stood first in solo song competition in sub-junior category and Vishal Delki stood first in junior category. They need a loud round of applause of course because they are just new to the system and becoming part of it. Other activities that we have in our school consists of scout and guide. We have almost 105 students 
including 62 scouts and 43 guides which attended a three days camp that was organized here in our school. We started this scout and guide in 2009 and since then 22 students have got governor's award, 27 students have attended national integration camp, 6 have attended national Zamburi camp and 22 students have attended state level Zamburi camp. Of course, 106 students successfully cleared third Soban this year. I'd like to tell you that the, we have house system in our school and club where we have divided our school into four houses and various clubs which include music, dance, drama, sports, art and craft, language, expression, etc. And these all give our students uh, to, you know, experience to learn new things and also help them to emerge as leaders and winners. Of course, uh, we also plan various seminars and workshops for our students which include career counselling, leadership skills, career planning, development and developing our students for various you know, career counselling and seminars we have planned this session as well. Various events are celebrated in our school, needless to say. Now I will talk about our teachers empowerment program. Teachers are also learners. Staying updated is the key to success. Last two years, I would like to of course tell you, you know, which was affected due to COVID and lockdowns, but all our teachers, they trained themselves for different challenging situations and proudly I can say that our school helped teachers by giving training to the nearby schools also. We were pioneering in starting the online classes and then we helped the nearby school also how to run online classes so that the nearby students of the villages, they also get benefited from our expertise. Regarding the future plans, I would like to inform you that very soon we are coming up with coaching facility which is a demand of all the parents because our children have to move to Kota and other places after 11th and 12th, even for 8th, 9th and 10th classes also to prepare them for NTSC and various Olympiads. Very soon our management has categorically agreed, so definitely this session we are coming up with a coaching program as well. Even our teachers have come up, so other than this NTSC, JED will also help students for CLAD, ILET, CPT and other programs as well. Further, we have plans for infrastructure development also to meet the future needs of the school. Hello. On this memorable occasion, as we recount our success with pride and happiness, we wish to dedicate all our achievements, committed efforts, to the committed team called OP Jindal School, Savitri Nagar. We humbly salute our patrons and visionary leaders from JPL of the past and great ones of the present and seek divine grace and blessings to guide us in all our endeavors. I would not, I would not forget to congratulate each and every student who has received the awards and those who will receive an award today. I am sure many of the younger recipients today will grace this stage again at future prize giving ceremonies. I would like to conclude with the famous lines of Dushyant Kumar. Sirf hanga ma khada karna mera maksad nahi. Sirf hanga ma khada karna mera maksad nahi. Meri koshis hai ki ye surat badalni chahiye. Mere sine mein nahi. Tere sine mein sahi. Ho kahi bhi aag. Ye aag jalni chahiye. Ye aag jalni chahiye. Thank you everyone.